Kay Adebola of Kikaloo. She is a current mathematician best known for her research in spectral geometry. She was born in 1965 in London, England, and she was born into a mathematical family. Her father was actually a professor of mathematics at the University of East Anglia, and he also published about 30 mathematical papers um, from 1965 to 1974. Her mother was a K-12 mathematics teacher, and her sister has a bachelor's degree in mathematics from the University of Cambridge, so they are a pretty mathematical family. Um, she herself has a bachelor's from the University of Cambridge, and she got her PhD from the University of California. So some of the research that she has participated in, um, in 1991, she was awarded her PhD for the thesis, um, the analog of the strong Zago limit theorem on the torus and the three sphere. She has published three joint papers, and you can read the names of those. The advances in the time period, um, so these are just a few things that influenced the mathematical findings of Okikulu. So in 1982, Mandelbrot publishes The Fractal Geometry of Nature, um, and I included this because a lot of what Okikulu researches does have to do with geometry, um, so that was pretty interesting that just in the decade before, those are some things, um, the geometry they're working on. In 1982, uh, Xing Tung Yao is awarded a Fields Medal for Contribution to Partial Differential Equations, which is one of the areas that Okikulu did a lot of research in. And then in 1989, um, Borgain solves long-standing problem in harmonic analysis. And that's another um, field that Okikulu is particularly interested in um, and has a lot of research in. So most of our current research is in spectral geometry, um, specifically the properties of the Laplacian on closed compact Riemannian manifolds under all smooth perturbations, centers around the frequencies at which an object vibrates, In her own words, she says, in mathematical terms, the natural frequencies of an object are the eigenvalues of a partial differential operator called the Laplacian. So some K-12 connections. Um, high school students don't typically learn exactly what um, Okikulu has been studying and her research is about, um, but they do be begin working with partial differential equations when they are in calculus, um, usually in a little bit in calculus AB and a lot in calculus BC. Um, they also cover Riemann sums, and this is not um, not a lot of what her research is about, but these are just some main building blocks to kind of build to what her research it covers. And some interesting facts. Um, so she actually has a project um, that I thought was pretty neat. She kind of gives back to the community. Um, she received an award where she aimed to fund workshops and make videos and math lessons for K-12 students. Um, she wanted this project um, to introduce them to current problems in geometric analysis. And she was also the first black recipient of the Sloan Research Fellowship.